There is not a single function to find if an year is leap year or not in Excel. But using month and date functions, you can determine if an year is leap year or not. The example worksheet has year 2016 and year 2017 in F4 and F5 cells. To find if the year is leap year or not, find the month of February 29th of the year. If it is a leap year, Excel returns the value as 2, but if it is not a leap year, Excel won't give any error, but instead it returns the value as 3. As it assumes, after February 28th, next date is March 1st and month of March is 3. Click on cell G4. In the formula bar, type equal to the function month within parenthesis, the function date within parenthesis, cell F4 which contains the year 2016, comma, the month, February month 2, comma, the date as 29th. Close the parenthesis, hit enter. You can see Excel displays the month number as 2 which means 2016 is a leap year. If you copy the formula to cell G5 using autofill handle, then Excel returns the value as 3 which means 2017 is not a leap year. You can also make it as a true or false by adding an if condition and validate against the value of 2. Add the if condition to check if the month returned is 2 or not. If it is 2, Excel returns value true, if not, false is returned. Add the function if. And check for the value equal to 2. If it is 2, type the return value as true. If it is not, false. Hit enter. You can see for year 2016, true is displayed, which is a leap year. If the formula is copied to cell G5 using autofill handle, false will be displayed for year 2017 because it is not a leap year.